Okay, I finally get, I got a day off, and I've already done one video today, and I seen a comment about using the onboard analog input on the FC6A. So I told him I'd do a quick video about it to kind of show you how to do that. So this is just a quick thing. I'm not going to make it work or nothing. I'm just going to show you real quick how to go in there and do it. You're going to open up Win LDR. Okay. Let's see, hopefully we got it open where you can see everything in here. My phone's ringing like batshit crazy. Uh, what's going on here? Why do I not have it? There we go. Okay, I've got an FC6A C24 down here. Okay, and basically all you do is go to module configuration. You make sure, not that, that's if you want to put an analog cartridge in. You just make sure the PLC itself is highlighted. Okay, go to configure. Then over here on this tab over here, you're going to go to input configuration and analog input one. All right, and it's where it stores. You can't change this. It stores the data in 8058 and 8060. So 8058 is where I believe it actually stores the data, 8058 and 8059. So pretty much you can link an analog, a, you know, on a HMI like a, um, a numerical output to this if you wanted to see it changing. But this is, this is a 0 to 10 only. You cannot change that. It has to be a 0 to 10 only. All right, and when you wire it up, the red is the positive, the black is the negative, and I believe the max voltage that you can actually feed it is 13 volts, but I don't think I would push that. I think I would stay around a 0 to 10 volt range DC. But with a potentiometer and a little and a power supply, you could that will do 10 volts. You can kind of vary it, and you can watch these data registers and see what they do just to kind of get an idea of how your, uh, your uh, inputs are working on your analog. But like I say, this is just 0 to 10 only. This is not a throttled 4 to 20 or a 0 to 20 milliamp. This is DC voltage. So anyhow, that's pretty much it on that. That's just a quick kind of show you where to get to on it.